hello um this is one of my videos um which i put on my channel um um i'm doing one of my first aid kits this is the one that i keep in my kitchen um that i do have to use a lot and i've only actually had to use it once but it's really good it's this big large first aid case um sorry that's my brother if you can hear him he's over in the way um um he's crying um so yeah i have that and then let's open it up and see what's inside so i'm just going to move the camera up and there's this there was some of the stuff in there. Um, I w I'm going to take the items out individually now. Oops, camera fell. So, first of all, I'm going to start off with the burns kit. I'll just put this little, it's, it's really small, um, like that. My arms are really small. <laughs> Um, it has a contents list on the back here and the quantity, the quantity and the description. Um, and then you open it up where well, everything goes falling out. Um, right, let me show what's in here. So first of all we have um, a f little first aid guide, not just on burns, it's got all sorts in there. So I like that in there. Um, I've got... Oops. Two hyperband conforming bandages, size 7.5 centimeters by 4 meters. I have, well, I did have three, but I had to use it. My nan burned herself. Um, we have um, burn stop, burn gel sachets, and in here, 3.5 grams in here. So they're good. I've only got two there now. I did have three. Uh, I've got a little pack of safety pins. I've got two. Are they large? Yeah. Two pairs of Hyperchurch vinyl gloves, latex, um, pre-powdered, latex free, but the pre-powdered. And then we have. Two absolutely massive, massive. There's the one, and there's the other one. Absolutely massive burn dressings, gel soaked. I'm really sorry about my brother. Uh, I'm going to pause the video now and don't tell him to be quiet. Right, so I told him to be quiet. I hope he's quiet. Now. Let's put that back in there. Next, I have. One, hang on, is there just the one? Yeah, just the one. Steroplast wound closures, uh, three millimeters by 75 millimeters, and there's a pack of five on here. You just rip the two pieces off and apply the closures on, so they're really good. If you don't know what they are, um. Um, on your comment or on your comment just put what are they and I'll answer for you um, I have two but they're different triangular bandages here's the first one this is a calico triangular bandage 92 centimeters by 92 centimeters by 131 centimeters and this one is an astroplast triangular bandage, non-woven, but it doesn't say the size at all, unfortunately. I'll try and find out. Um, here I have a silver foil blanket. And there's... Yeah. And then next... I have Boots Pharmaceuticals, five sterile gauze swabs, BP, um, yes, 
BP for cleaning, drying, and dressing wounds. I know that. Um, 7.5 centimeters by 7.5 centimeters. So the little squares are really, they're really good to have to clean, dry, and dress the wound. Next, which is a little bit like that, I have, and this is from Wilkinson. This was about 80p or something. This is really good. And we have some white lint for applying medications and for dressing wounds um and it's 45 centimeters by 10 centimeters um that's really good i like to keep that um and i think yeah we've only got one pair of gloves and here we have saint john ambulance nitrile uh, powder free examination gloves medium one pair uh 100 nitrile de 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 <laughs> Dermis, oh, I can never say it. Um, and they're disposable. Um, I have a load, I'm just trying to get them all, of plasters. Plasters. Uh, but they're not, these aren't all of them. This is just some of them. They're all in different shapes and sizes. Different makes. We've got them. Um, Hydroplast, Astroplast, Masterplast. Um, I'm one, one has got the make on, but yeah, I like her to have them in here. I, th I thought we had more than one. I can't find the other ones. Um, sterile wound cleansing wipes. There's one of them. I can't find the rest of them. Um, and, oh, and the size is for that, doesn't say. Next, I have a blue dot medium cell first aid dressing, and the pad size is 12 centimeters by 12 centimeters, doesn't say the bandage um, measurements. Um, here I've just got some blue. Um, paper towels I like to use for nose bleeds, all sorts of things. They're really handy that I have in my first aid kit. And next up, I have um, in lots of different sizes, but I can't find the rest of them. Like ag again, um, non-adherent and some are, um, adhesive dressing pads, and this size is 10 centimeters by 10 centimeters. I like to have for them. Next up, I have a pair of St. John Ambulance tweezers that I bought off Amazon for 10p, which are really good. Next, I have um, the Cool Pack Original Instant Ice Pack. This is a long one, um, the instructions are on the back. And you can get small square ones that, which I've had in the past. I bought them in a box of 20. Next, I have Saint, a St. John Ambulance Revive Aid, which is a resuscitation mask. Uh, there's no other details, really. Next, I have, and I'm sure there's another roll that I put in. Yeah, there is. Of some microporous tape. Is really good, and I think I think that that's it. Yeah, that that's it for this um, video. This is just a little short video on my first aid kit that I keep in the kitchen. I actually got this box for Christmas. Um, I'm trying to find. I put some eye wash in here. I think I yeah I had to use it unfortunately. Uh, I'll have to try and find some more to put in there. Um, if you have any tips or anything that I need to add in here, please comment on that. Um, and as I always say, please comment, like, and subscribe. Bye.